Welcome to Technical Studies. In this video, I will show you how to make a single column and its base plate, and how to modify both. If you have any suggestions, please comment. As you open E3D, you will see this window. Left click on the project. Click on Options and on Configuration. In the coordinates, choose ENU. Click on the General tab and on the site. Name the site 001. Click on the zone and name 002. Click on the discipline and click on the structures. Click on the sections. Click on the structure and write 003. Click on framework and name 004. Click on the subframe and write 005. Choose the profile specification, British Standard Profile. Click on Universal Column. In the profile, select 203 by 203 by 60. In the class column, select column. Select any material or leave it as it is. Select the justification N, A, neutral axis. In the Create section, click on Straight and select Single. In the pop-up ribbon, type 0, in, E, and click the Tab button on the keyboard. Type 0, in N. In the U, type 0, and click the Enter button on the keyboard. New pop-up will appear. Type 0, in, E and N. Don't forget to click the tab button. In the U, write 5000 mm. And click the enter button. You have created a 5000 mm long beam. Let us learn how to change the profile. Click on the property bar. Click on specification. Click on Reference. Click on the Type and choose the Universal Column. Choose UC 254 into 254 into 89. Click on the tab Fitting and click on the beam. In the property bar, select Base Plate. Click on the rectangular base plate. Select anyone and click the apply button. Double click on the neutral axis of the column. Save the project. In the next tutorial, 
we will learn how to make copies, trim, split, connection plates, etc. Thank you for watching.